Previously on Quests and Coffee. Oh, here we go. Cutscene. Oh, but that is weird looking. I require gold. Sure. What's one gold between friends? If she gets greedy, then we kill her. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that might happen. Ooh. Oh, she like ate it. Again. No. Again? No, that's mm -hmm. not how this works. Okay, well maybe again, but you have to help me first. Uh, how much do you want? I don't hand out so much gold for so little in return. Yes. Yeah. You may pass the river, but first you must pay. I, I collect the gold. The gold so you may pass. Yeah, I want to know how much she wants. Have. She wants everything. Aww. You're not getting no. the gold. No. No. I don't think so. No. <laughs> well, we might as well. Let's see. Why stay in this rotted building? Or I'm here to replace you. I'm here to replace you as toll collector. <laughs> uh, uh, sure. Let's. Uh, it's a bad check. I've already paid. Yes. Again. Okay. Well, it's pretty clear that this is how where this is gonna go. Oh no! I require gold. Me. Breakout's taking a drink. Not sure I want to drink any of this. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this guy. Wow. Gross. You'll hold. Oh, oh. <laughs> it stitches. That looks safe enough. Yeah. <laughs> braver dragon than I am. <laughs> if I am will, yet. What will you do? It just says pick it up. Yeah, it doesn't say drink. It says pick it up. Leaning in, you can see how the creature's skin barely holds it together. <laughs> the bulge of its belly is on the cusp of bursting wide open. Pleasant. <laughs> Can you drink it until it, like, explodes? Can you make it drink until it explodes? Yeah. This guy's passing out. It's like, yes, I do. No, not never. Father said, order commanded. This is his son. Don't say it. Urcage. Urcage. Yeah, we should remember that. Sounds important. Buried in his tomb. I can't bear it. No. No. Oh, he's going to explode <laughs> on you. It's coming. Here it comes. Strong. Look out, break out. Oh, oh my Gross. gosh. Okay. Thank you. Do some potions of feather fall and. They describe a powerful a venom thing. extracted from a rare purple worm. Distill a thizzable thorn sought to create a fatal poison using the worm's gullet. 
He procured several parts of a worm gullet, but rinsed one in error. The poison he brewed was noxious, but not fatal. Visible devoted months to formulating a deadly poison. After exhaustive experimentation, he was able to make a near-deadly extract from the glands. But to complete his poison, Thisbald required one last ingredient, the petals of a corpse rose. The book's index reveals corpse roses may grow near tombs, mausoleums, and particularly redolent cadavers. Thisbald enlisted a courier from Baldur's Gate to obtain corpse rose petals and other ingredients and deliver them to a covert location. Unfortunately, a deep purple stain darkens the final page, obscuring the parcel's destination. Ooh, okay, you have an investigation. Oh, let's see if I can... I think my investigation is pretty good. And then, yeah. Nice. Ah, yeah, there you there go. go. Well done. <laughs> 26 crushed it. Your mind separates the black from the blue. Revealing the stash's location. You mark your map as a reminder. Nice. With the corpse rose yeah, cool. petals the package contains, you might create Thisbald's purple worm poison. The air stirs in trepidation. You have the ledger. <laughs> How do you know I have the ledger? The raven always knows. Should we have him tell us, or just give it to him? Yeah, let's let's hear the story again. To punish a murderer. If that is not enough, leave. I have no time for those lacking commitment. We have it. Her lies. Her guilt. Madeline reported her friends to a dark justicia and fled when they were butchered. Well, she flees no more. I will be the conduit for Madeline's spirit. I will force her to face trial. And you will be the judge. Make her beg. Make her suffer. Careful. For a serpent in life is a serpent in death. <laughs> Haggai's gonna Haggai. <laughs> <laughs> Witness. <sighs> Creepy. Mm -hmm. You. You said I was going to be punished. That you'd be the judge. But I didn't mean to hurt anyone. Said. It didn't mean nothing. That Ben and Mark were just drunk and whining. The Dark Justicia promised she was gonna chat with him. She promised. The Dark Justicia said to report everything, big or small. She ain't the type you say no to. She gave him a dagger each and told him to press it against their stomachs on the count of three to start stabbing and not stop till she said so. Yikes. She never said stop. Yeah. I'd do anything to take it back. Anything. You're right. I'm a killer. A monster. I didn't I say you're a killer, I said you're a coward. <laughs> died instead. <gasps> yeah. That's justice. Ah, glorious. Look, okay, you're weird, dude. My hand still <laughs> shakes. You broke her most thoroughly. Well done. Perhaps. But we both got what we wanted. Didn't we? So he lied to you. I've done well. I don't know about this okay, guy. I don't like him as much as I did a minute ago. No, I don't like him. I will treasure it. Here. For your services. Should I find another murderer in need of torment? I shall call upon you. <laughs> Previously on Quests and Coffee. Oh, here we go. Cutscene. What do you oh, but that is weird looking. I require good. 
Sure. What's one goal between friends? If she gets greedy, then we kill her. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like that might happen. Ooh. Oh, she like ate it. Again! No. Again? No, that's mm -hmm. not how this works. Okay, well, maybe again, but you have to help me first. Uh, how much do you want? I don't hand out so much good for so little in return. Yes. Yeah. You may pass the river, but first you must Good morning, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome to uh, Quests and Coffee back after some a week off last week due to uh, injury and... Uh, <laughs> uh, you said doo -doo. <laughs> I did, did, did. I did. I said I'm going to make lots of little flubs today, I'm sure, but because uh, we're out of practice. But I'm happy to be back. I, I love this game, and we've been we were talking amongst ourselves that we miss it in the week off, and we kind of forget what we're doing because we have bad memories and that kind of stuff. But we are playing Baldur's Gate 3, and uh, we are in the Gauntlet of Shar in the midst of Act 2. Currently, we are looking, we are on the main quest, Infiltrate Moonrise Towers, and we are trying to find Cetheric Thorm's relic. We uncovered a secret passage in the mausoleum. The relic has to be further inside. So this place looks awesome. If you watched our last stream, we just uh, finished off right at the beginning of what looks to be a sort of combat gauntlet, which I'm very excited to try and do today. And it's going to be extra challenging because we don't have our full party. We are missing one of our comrades today. Breakout could not be here today. So I will be playing the role of the Dragonborn Cleric. We are all level six, uh, very close to leveling to a seven, actually. So you'll probably see that on stream today, which is mm. always fun. Um, but uh, as I said, Breakout is a cleric, a dragonborn cleric of the light. I almost said cleric of the circle. That's you, Sparrow. <laughs> Your, mm -hmm. Sparrow is the druid of the circle, currently in panther form, right? Yep, yep. Good morning, Sparrow. How are you? I know you're sick, but so I appreciate yeah, you Yeah, I'm here. sick, but I'm excited to be here. I missed playing. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. And Fate, as well, is here on the wizard, as usual. Hi, Fate. Hello. Good. And uh, I am playing a fighter. Level seven, uh, level six fighter, one level of ranger thrown in there for some of the ranged uh, abilities. And I actually decided to change up my companion. I've been using the crab companion, AKA Pinchy, for much of our, uh, the entirety of our adventures. Pinchy will be making, uh, taking a week off <laughs> and we'll be using Quoth or Quoth the Raven, but I don't like that name. So we're going to call the Raven Crow because Crow is one of our friends mm -hmm. and we like Crow. So. Crow will be joining us and doing blinding is that was that is what the uh, crow's ability is, so hopefully that helps out. Um, you could have had um, you could have had Pinchy here ready for anybody not wearing green. Ah <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn, I missed opportunity there. I should have known. You're right. Pinchy's off pinching people in a bar somewhere. He's he's celebrating in his own way. <laughs> Uh, good morning everybody in chat just let me play the damn game has been here since the beginning good morning to you and uh, we were talking about they've been playing final fantasy 7 and uh, rebirth and i know uh nathan's been playing that some of our other friends getting into that arlon is here welcome good morning and uh yeah uh do they do they get the healing breath weapon he's talking about breakout i don't know i've just been sort of trying to give myself a crash course on how to play breakouts character and the key concept here is uh radiant damage if you look at his spell setup um He's all about radiant damage. He's got armor and items that enhance the radiant damage and actually cause it to do a little more. So that's the focus to do the damage. And then, of course, the cleric just keeping us alive. Still alive. 
so that's progress. That's right. It is progress. Um, okay, so you guys ready to go? Yeah, I'm ready. Yeah, I'm ready. All right. So if you what, look out, what exactly where are we at? <laughs> like, so, what are we doing? Yeah, in front of us is an ancient altar. Ancient altar, and I think we clicked on that before. And there's also a traversal gem mm -hmm. over here. We did oh not click on any of this stuff. No. So we're trying to figure out because there's, there's. I'm remembering now. There's paths to the left and right up ahead that like go down, or yeah. up here, back up here. That's correct. That go down, and we weren't, we weren't sure whether we should click on the altar or go in the paths. So we stopped. We we stopped on a little cliffhanger here. So mm -hmm. I guess we can just like click on the stuff and see what happens. Yeah, so that's a. To... That's always my first option. Click on the stuff. Oh. See what happens. Okay, so you started I mean, uh, a conversation. Okay, I'm joining. Brave the gauntlet of your lady Shah. Surmount her trials and rise a dark justicia. Oh, nice. History option, religion. Okay, DC 10. Nice. Oh, no. Oh, oh you no. failed it. Do you have inspiration? Uh, I hope so. Yeah, I got some. Okay, yeah, you might as well use it. There we, there go. we go. That's fine. Can't have our wizard failing in intelligence. Being an inner circle of Shah followers, <laughs> elite warriors loyal to their last breath. Okay. Hmm. <sighs> okay. Maybe I'll, I'll, I'll try the I'll try the religion check real quick. No, this one's a bit Can harder. It, ooh. Can you have Breakout hit me with the uh, guidance? I think. Guidance. Um, yeah. I, it's not showing me. Isn't it's not showing giving me that option. I think maybe because I'm not close enough. If you want to back out of this, if there's any way you can back out, I can try and. <laughs> I don't think I can back out now. Mm. I think I have to either do it or not. Okay. I'll just go for it. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, I'm not gonna use an inspiration no. on that. No. Nothing comes to you. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Your mind there is blank. recesses on the altar that look intended to house something. Another such receptacle already contains a gemstone. Uh, oh, so we got to find the gemstones? Yeah. Mm. Experienced okay. RPG players here. <laughs> you see a receptacle <laughs> with one in it. What Fill the other one with something. Okay, so there's also this trans traversal be. gem down here. Let me click yeah, on Yeah, which probably takes us down to that little platter down there, I would assume. Yeah, to start finding the gems. Okay. But I'm... it might not work without the gems, yeah. Let me click it and see what happens. Uh, maybe not. <laughs> maybe, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. So well, if we, go... we want to go Yeah, we got to go left back. Or right? Up. So let's go left. Remember we saw that displacer beast down there? Oh, yes, that's right. right. Up okay. here. Well, let's mm. go. Let's go. I love I mean, I don't love them because they always killed me back in the day. But uh, <laughs> displacer beasts are nasty. They, they they were featured in the movie for a good reason. <laughs> right. They okay. are one of the iconic um, enemies. Yes, they are. Okay. Uh, should I just initiate this attack? You think? Oh, this is interesting. When I went stealth, the uh, the fire here became a little circle. I don't, I don't think I've ever noticed that before. Mm, interesting. Okay. Oh, thanks, Farlon. I appreciate that. Yeah, yesterday kind of sucked. The technical issues with the Saturday morning stream didn't uh, work out, but I'm glad that it's working this morning. So let's, yeah, let's initiate combat. I will start with a, uh, I'll shoot, I'll put the hunters. Do I have hunters, Mark? Um, it's, I don't think it's available to me at this point. But we're just going to take a shot at the Displacer Beast. Oh. Okay. Oh man, there is more than just a displacer beast. <laughs> There's a lot of stuff. Maragons. Wow, what are those? Your gear. Okay. We've got 85 hit points. All right. Yeah. So. What the heck? A hoarding Maragon trader. Yeah, let's uh, let's just uh, let's get in there. We gotta get in there close before he gets to me. Was that displacer beast hostile before you attacked it? Mm, it was. No, I don't think so. Because this guy's like a traitor over here. I wonder if we could have. Uh... 
Hmm. Could have like talked to them. All right, Misty step down. We're gonna do a. Uh... I don't think I can knock them prone. That's not gonna work out. I can try. Why can't I get there? I missed. I have to jump, I guess. Oh, there they are. Okay, they're up on the. <laughs> what? What is going on over there? There's like a gathering of them. Okay, so now it's Breakout's turn. I've got to figure out what I'm doing with Breakout here. Missed. Missed, wow. Okay, Breakout's going to come down here. My feet. And you know what? We're going to we're gonna do Fairy Fire on the Displacer Beast. Is it on all of us? It is. <laughs> I, I, I'm not sure that was intended. That's okay. Incoming attacks have advantage on us. And I can't be invisible now. <laughs> I thought I could have... Mm. Okay, well, that's that's learning they're learning Breakout's character. Oh, I gotta <laughs> be the Raven still. Got Crow has a turn here. Okay, Crow, you go down here. Why can't you get there? Oh, you can. Just gotta fly. Okay. Oh so boy. It doesn't look like... Oh yeah, they're surprised, so they're gonna take a turn to get into the action here. Alright. Hey, Chiro, dude. Good morning. Thank you. It's good to be back. Okay. Um, what do we want to do here now? I'm just going to attack, get him before he can get us. So uh, I did hit him with a crit, but the impulse blast he resisted or he saved against it. So didn't knock him down, which is fine. Okay. This. He gets like an attack with each of his tentacles. <laughs> Okay, so what did he just try to do there? That was kind of crazy. Displaced? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, what is displaced? I mean, he, he moved himself. And left a creature. Okay. Yeah, weird. So these guys are kind of just moving around over here. What are these things? I have no idea what Amerigon even is. No, I've never even seen them before in any context. All right, let's get Breakout down here to do some damage. Very nice. So we have to kill the other one before we kill the main one? Is that how this place for beasts work again? I can't remember. I don't remember either. Did it did it not take damage? I thought it did take damage. Well, the, not. the one is at 18 hit points. The other one appears to be un, uninjured. Yeah, um, I did two damage to it. Okay. Let's see. Let's do... Oh, crap. Can let's do like... Sacred Flame on the damaged one. Okay, that one's down to eight. Yeah, my MMO lore would say kill the main one and the pet one would go away. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I think that's I think that might be actually fine. I think that's probably what we want to actually do. Oh, what? I didn't get an attack. Weird. Invisible. You've gone invisible, yeah. Alright, it's time for the it's time for the creatures to attack. We got Crow. Okay. 
He saved. Yeah. I knock. See that? Okay, well. Crow got it. Got three down on him. Oh, they're like up there. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, I'm not sure what they're what they're going, what they're doing up there. They seem to have some sort of strategy, but I'm not sure what it is. All right, let's see if I can finish this guy off. I should be. Able to. I get two attacks. One of them has to hit, and I missed with both. Wait, what just happened there? Oh, oh nice. It was just what delayed. Just happened? It was just there was a weird delay there. I think. Nice. We got experience for both. Right. Okay. Uh, do we need heals? Yes. Um, we're still in combat, so yes. Uh, I will do... I'll take my second wind. Okay. Now, where are those other guys? Are they down here? They're, they're down the stairs, but they're not. They're, they're up. There's like a ledge above the stairs. Mm -hmm. Okay, I see it. <clears throat> I was thinking if we want to keep waiting for them, like... like scrunch ourselves up to either side of the column I can throw down an area of effect thing that they have, they'll have to go through to get get to us okay that sounds good so do you want me to move back behind like over where breakout is where do you want to where do you um, wanna assemble us here how do I how do I do this yeah. there right we go then? like okay. right there yeah, 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 or yeah. right there going. okay I'll go there let's see if they make their way over here looks like that's what their plan is oh I see what they're doing So that guy's up on, he's going to try and do some range damage from up there, it looks like. And these other ones are... Oh, I didn't see that up over there. Interesting. Yeah, they're all coming down. Looks like it's going to take them a long time to get down here. We might be able to just sort of take them one at a time if we play our cards right here. So this is the guy that we can probably hit the edge, the guy on the edge there. I wonder if... Hmm. Maybe I'll, I'll hold off on using this spell then. Um. Okay, I'm gonna break it's gonna heal. Breakout needs a big heal. Can you bonus heal me? Uh yes. How bad they are, yeah, you're pretty badly injured. Let's get you let's get you there. There you go. If they come around the that bend at a big clump, then yeah, I can I can like do some damage to them. But I'll hold off. I thought they were gonna jump down here onto the stairs and come up that way. Some of them might do it, but it looks like some of them are not planning on doing that. Yeah, just the one guy looks like he might be doing it. The other ones are gonna come up the stairs from a long way away there. Mm -hmm. hey. Nice twenty crit. That fairy fire, I think, is keeping me from going in viz. Yeah. Hmm. Mm. Okay, so he's going to try and range us from up there. Interesting. Uh, you know what? I could send the crow up there to try and blind that guy. I wonder if that's a good idea. Can I get that there? Let's see. Yeah, I can. Incoming crow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and the crow. The crow's gone. <laughs> well, he. Oh, he jumped down. Okay. <clears throat> Crow had his moment. Oh, ow. Sentinel. Nice. Yeah. Good combat roll so far. OK. 
Okay, let's I should be able to finish this guy off. One more. There we go. Hey, level up. Oh. That's excellent. Okay, one down. And we're just gonna wait here for the next one to come, I guess. Yeah. They just grouping up there and waiting? I don't know what they're doing. Yeah, they all just are waiting. Like, the <laughs> they're using our strategy. Hey, we are the players. You're the NPCs. We're supposed to be the ones <laughs> turtling and waiting for you to come to us. This is how, this is how they gaming just run works. in dumbly, right? Yeah, you're supposed to run in stupidly. Exactly. All right. Well, that's why I have a level in Ranger, I guess. So you want to range us? Are you going to wait it out? We'll just range you from down here. Oh, I got to do breakout. Duh. You know what? These guys are actually grouped up pretty well. I'm going to send breakout over here and do an AOE. Radiance. Believe it. Which, which spell is it? I just saw it a second ago. Oh, it's Radiance of the Dawn. He's already used it. Okay. So... to keep going over there I wonder if I can pull one of these guys down here disadvantage because I'm below but time for some blood in a truck good idea Oh, did you see that jump? Oh my god. <gasps> Holy crap. Oh, yikes. Okay. Uh, breakout's gonna do <laughs> miss with a reaction. Okay, so fate needs a heal. Okay. I can heal fate for a little bit. So this is your gear. And just while you're thinking about what you're doing, I'm going to examine him. Resistant to cold, immune to fire, immune to poison, immune to all types of basically uh, melee damage. Excuse me. Um, yeah. He's tough. Resistant to almost everyone. Yeah. Level 10 fiend. Not resistant to owl bears. I won't be able to attack, but yeah, still. <laughs> gotta get break. Gotta get breakout out of there now. <laughs> oh, they're all coming down now. <laughs> okay. All right. Um. What is my? What's the play here? Yeah, he was resist to poison. I said don't use any poison. I can try and like no, that's not good. Um alright, well I'm just you know what? I am going to haste. No. I don't wanna use my I don't wanna use my turn just to haste myself. Just straight up attacks on this guy. <laughs> kind of laughs. <laughs> <at you. laughs> I'll Did we end up doing that AOE down there at all? No, I, I couldn't tell what direction they were going. Yeah, we, might, we might be in trouble here. This is, a, this is a tough one. I didn't uh, I didn't know there was all these. I thought it was just the Displacer Beast. We might be looking at a reload. No, 
know, like these guys are all 45 hit points. The big guy has 95. Oof, man, this is <laughs> that's really tough. Oh yeah, black tentacles, that's off one of your items, right? That's cool. That was a good call. I like that. Oh no! Ooh, nice! <laughs> Critical hit on Brave Dang. Ooh, yikes. Okay. Not looking good. Not looking good at all here. Hey, where'd he go? Invisible. Oh. What's You're going to be in my rupture, but I'm hoping to... Yeah, that's fine. Hit him. I can take it. Did, you got there it. we go. Right. <laughs> so good. All right, that's what I got. Yeah, it's close at hand. Yikes! I'm, <laughs> I'm wearing. I'm in trouble. <laughs> I gotta use a potion at least, if nothing else, to help me survive a little longer, but... There's something hitting this guy decently, but it's just not I don't think I can outlast him. Oh, he cancelled your rage. Yep. <clears throat> Hey, Athan, good morning. Oh, it's good to see you, too. We, uh... It's funny how your weekend is disrupted when you don't uh, do the things you're used to doing. <laughs> Last weekend was very strange, not streaming at all on the weekend, but it's good to be back at it. Although, we don't seem to be doing very well <laughs> from a gameplay standpoint. I think we're about to... Uh, we might be looking at a reload here. What do you guys think? Do you want to just call it and reload from here? It looks like, or do you think we have a chance here? Yeah, I don't know um, if we have a chance. Might have a chance. Um, okay. Let me try. I rely, I rely on the optimism, optimism of my group mates. <laughs> Seems like you're in a pickle. We are in a pickle. We are in a pickle. Yeah. But I love pickles. So. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if you're going to be in something, <laughs> better to be in a pickle than a jam. <laughs> well, I don't know about that. <laughs> I think I love jam more than pickles. Yeah, they're both pretty good. <laughs> okay. Conjured a minor elemental. The mud method. It should be two of them. Is there not two of them? I only see I one. See oh, there one. is. You see him? They're on top of each other, but there's two. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, there you go. Now I see him. <laughs> oh, no. Toy. Oh, no. <laughs> he went invisible again. Oh, Did he? No, no he, he came back. Uh, or no. didn't. I don't know. Are you going to be able to jump out of the way? I think no. I'm dead. <laughs> I think I'm toast. I can't. I'm not doing any jumping. Oh, there you go. Okay. Killed one of my methods, but they explode Sorry. when they die. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. It's part of the. Oh, all right. They explode when they die, so it's part of what. Uh, why I summoned them. That was the plan. 
All right, some of them are feel fearful. Yep, including the boss, which is a good thing. Yeah. I think that's it, though. Oh. Chopping away. Ah. <laughs> Ow. Yeah, that's this might be. Yeah, they're hitting too hard. All right, L reload. Okay, reload. See what this does. Okay, <laughs> I'll let you finish what you're doing. Oh, nice. I don't know what that did, but it seems like it did a lot. Killed two of them. Yeah. All right. Well, you know what? You guys, you go. I mean. It's up to you. We can. We, what are you doing down there? Oh, he's trying. fearful. You made him fearful. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, but you made my my method fearful. Oh. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, wow. Okay. We might, we might be able to, yeah. to yeah, do this. You got I the boss know. down to 17. If you can live, I don't know, but you're both pretty damaged. <laughs> and face. Oh, yep. There I go. Jeez. <laughs> oh, Come on, Albert. <laughs> Show him what the Albert is all about. Rawr. God damn. The Alberts are so good. <laughs> all right. It's all on you, Sparrow. Oh boy. He's gonna knock me out. Muffet, though, he took a hit for me. This is where legends are born, Sparrow. Yep. See the look in your eyes. <laughs> <laughs> you look like you're ready. They hit so hard though. As soon as I'm out, I'm gonna get yeah. one shotted. <laughs> <laughs> yep. And as you say it, it happens. Twenty-five hit yeah. points. Boss is coming back. He's not afraid anymore. Aha! <laughs> Chopping away. Yeah, this might be. All right. Time for the reload. Load time. <laughs> <laughs> reload. Well. I had them where, right where I wanted them. Yeah, you sure did. They were, they were <laughs> within a, a whisker of being your being your next victims. Well, that happens sometimes. We've we've had that happen a couple times so far in our adventure where you just kind of get overwhelmed and uh, you got to reload. That's that's why they uh, that's why you can't do that. So we will talk to the thing again and. Uh, that dialogue and then we'll uh reconsider our strategy so uh you know what oh yeah you want to maybe talk? heal up before we go in this time yeah <clears throat> brave the gauntlet of your lady shah hey tolmar recesses on the altar Hi, tolmar. Look intended to how are you something good and... to see you what happened you didn't miss anything because we were right back where we started when we started the stream so you're <laughs> jumping in right at the perfect moment you just didn't see us fail okay so um we went that was the direction we went before and we weren't sure if the displacer beast was actually hostile maybe let's try the other side what do you think guys time to press ahead mm -hmm. yeah sure okay you know what i need to um yeah, i need to group myself with uh, oh i need to summon my guy too where's where's crow does breakout have like a group heal he does not So if we head over this way, we can go down this way and see what's down here. All right. <clears throat> what now? No heals. Oh, sorry. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Okay. Uh, let me throw a heal on you. Let me break out here. Looking ahead. Um. Oh, that didn't do oh boy. much. No. <laughs> Teleport sigil, sigil down here. Oh, cool. Let me get you with a better one. There you go. Awesome. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Back to teleport sigil. Oh. Hmm. 
This next time's the charm. This is uh, this is like an elevator, but we need the the lever for it. Oh, I see. Okay. Interesting. There's a lever there. Right beside breakout is a lever. A lever base. It doesn't actually have the oh. lever in it. Yeah, you gotta actually gotcha. get the device. <clears throat> yeah, okay, it's good. So we found that uh, transportation, the quick travel sigil there. There's a little rat here. Hey, somebody talk to this rat. Who has talked to animals? Sparrow? I do, yeah. Um. Unworthy. Unworthy to walk among friendly bones. Leave! Um... <laughs> calm down. Talking of you, intruder, invader, unworthy one. These halls are not for you. Hmm. <laughs> uh, we have two Just options. Maybe, <laughs> Threatening or, or leaving. Yeah. Threaten them or leave them. I mean, we don't... I'm not anti-rat. I can... I can just back away. We learned our lesson from starting fights. <laughs> now we're going to play very passively. <laughs> mm -hmm. Is there anything over here? Is there anything? There's another rat over here. Uh, well, they probably all say the same thing, but... Oops. <laughs> the sneaking panther. <laughs> okay, so he was warning us. So let's, let's see what's up. So we can go down past a rat or we can go up. Well, let's go up. I guess we're going up. Yeah. There's a hanging corpse up there. A very click. gory idea of art. Does it do anything when you click on it? Just says that. Oh, there's a mob up there. It's a marksman. Right. Oh, it's one of those guys we 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 fought beside. Um, right. So against the dark justice years. These are friendly, right? Friendly-ish. <laughs> Friendly-ish. They're not hostile. <laughs> there's like a, yeah, there's some sort of like throne with a bunch of candles or an altar of some sort over here. Let's go take a look. Hmm. So behind the altar, yeah, these are just the reconstituted Allies. There's a locked vault door. Hurry inside, or your racket is liable to. Uh oh. Prancer Donkey Scrotum! <laughs> the breaks herald the shadows. <laughs> it's already too late. your avenger and are those those guys are still our yeah they're still on our side so that's good but they go down super easily <laughs> remember from the last battle they did not they cannot take a lot of punishment it's just the one guy right right the one bad guy there's an umbral umbral tremor over here that i can attack yeah, yeah. i think we need to take them out but they're they're kind of tough to take out they're very resistant to damage except for radiant damage okay well you know who that calls for I don't have... well, that's a break up my luck again I'll attack it, but it probably won't do much. Oh, I took it out. Okay, I'm gonna hit the, the Umbral Tremor here with radiant damage. Oh, okay, this one. Oh, target cannot be an inanimate entity. I can't target it with with mm -hmm. Sacred Flame. Um, I want to save my Spirit Guardians for a more difficult fight. I don't feel like this is the fight for Spirit Guardians. Let's see if I can actually just destroy it with melee damage. Oh, 
Oh, it's down to one. Okay. Breakout can Never finish it off. I'll strike you down. Oh, I forgot to drink alcohol with Breakout. I forgot that he's better when he's drunk. <laughs> I should do that. I'll do that on my... Oh, ah, maybe I can do that. There we go. Breakout is properly lubricated. We gotta try not to hit the other guys. Oh yeah, right. The daily. important is ever easy. Survival is all that matters. Now here they come. Oh, they're happy. And there's one more umbral tremor up there. Gotta get up there. Yeah. I can't get to it unless I'm dashing. Okay. And then I won't be able to attack. Oh, actually, it won't let me dash. So I might as well just get as close as I can. You know what you can do, Sparrow? If you because if you can't get mm -hmm. past this guy, can you get to it without? Oh, you're over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, you're yeah. right. I thought you were by us. Yeah, I just can't attack this round. Right. I don't think. You can get close to it though. Yeah, that's about as close as True. I can get. <laughs> True, dude. I knew you'd like that. <laughs> I was waiting for your mm -hmm. for response. He's gonna be near that. Oh, there's two. Oh, there's more now. Ooh. So is he summoning them? Should we? Yeah. So we'll focus on him. You worry about those tremors over there, Sparrow, and we'll focus on okay. taking out Mr. Avenger here. Oh, crap! There's a bunch more tremors. <laughs> He's down to thirteen. Still breathing, despite everything. Okay, he's done. Oh, good. Is he gonna pop out of one of these? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Maybe. That's what I'm kind of wondering, too. So, did the. Oh, yeah, there's a bunch more. Okay, there's one over here. Breakout's gonna go over here these and get this one. Seen everything. So just fate. Nice. Medic received condition undead. Where's a ghoul medic? I don't see him. That is weird. Ghoul medic's up by me. Oh, is he? Or, sorry, no, that's the Avenger. Never mind. <clears throat> Breath. Try and destroy this tremor here. <clears throat> Can only hit it once. Sometimes the only way out is through. Well, I'm gonna hit the tremor actually with their we'll hit it with a ranged. Tremor is gone. I don't think I can hit. Oh yeah, no I can. Do that. Okay, so just the one tremor left behind us and that's it. Yeah, no, there's three tremors. Oh, oh there's a deep umbral tremor somewhere. It's right in the center. Okay, let's focus on the oh, deep one. <laughs> the deep one in the center. Yeah. Okay. 
of the dash. So it seems like it's one of those, like, you hit enough of them, get enough of them down, then the deep one pops up, and that'll be the, maybe, be the end of it. Avenger. Let's get this. So just let me attack first before you try anything. Oops. Wait. Did you hit me? <laughs> I, I missed you. <laughs> I don't know why it yeah. does it. It's so hard to, like, okay, I want to target the deep one. Bull tremor. Hey, okay, attack that. <laughs> Derek. <laughs> it's, it's like. Ooh, nice. Right in a row. Beauty. Oh, it's saved. Oh, Bugger. I, it didn't actually hit either of them. Yeah. Oh, wait. Are they immune to lightning? Uh, no, it doesn't look like they're immune to lightning. That was a good idea, though. Yeah. I wonder if it's worth the cost. Hmm. <clears throat> okay, Breakout's got a dash Excuse me. to get in there. Does anybody need a heal? Oh, Sparrow could use a heal. Okay, maybe I won't dash. I'll go up here Another and I'll heal forward. Sparrow. No, oh, I can't get close enough to you. Shoot. Take your revenge on me, Sparrow, please. <laughs> no, I'm trying to. I can't, like, target it. Yeah, it's hard. So if right. you click on the top, I, what I did was, so click your attack, like yeah. on your weapon attack, and then click on the portrait at the top on the order, the turn order. It's the one in the middle. There you go. Nice. Down to nine. It's the deep, yeah. And this fight should level us up. Level me up. Nice. Okay, that one's gone. Right. These reconstituted guys. Kind should of I go for the guy or for the other tremor? Um, that's a good question. He's going for you, so maybe go for the guy. Yeah. Okay. Oh, see, so yeah, they just they keep reviving the Avengers. That we keep tumble. Emerald Tremors are doing. Okay, I gotta, I gotta get up there. There's a Misty Step. Misty Step is a bonus action. Good. That's what we want. Which one are you taking out, Fate? The one by you? Um. Yeah, I'm gonna try. Okay, I'm gonna, try I'm gonna do the one over by Sparrow here. Ah, <laughs> uh, this didn't do what I was hoping it would do. <laughs> no. Uh, okay, so can I get Breakout over there? I don't think I can, unfortunately. I'm having, tr I'm having trouble because my A, I'm like, I'm, I'm built for AoE damage. And most of my, I'm realizing most of my AoE spells do not hit this, these, these things. Mm. So, I'll, I'll, I might just like, uh... Stick to um, can trips after this. On my way.
Hmm. Yeah. I, if you can, can you hit the tremor here, the seven health tremor? Are you able to hit it from where you are? I mean, it'll probably. He'll probably hit me, right? There you oh, go. Maybe not. And yeah, we just got to take out these tremors, or else they're just going to keep rezzing the just the CRs here. Thing. Over here. Where did you go? Oh no! He missed me. <laughs> he missed me. <laughs> it's got some sort of effect going on there. Right. Oh, he's got mental fatigue and radiating orb on him, so he's in bad shape. Nice. <laughs> yeah, good job. Constituted dude. One more tremor. Oh, we just didn't get it in time before he could do another one. All right. Um, we're going to go. Ah, oh, you took my spot, you reconstituted duelist. Nice. That's it for the tremors. Perfect. Okay, we're just going to range this guy down. Wait, how do I not have enough movement? Don't forget, you can jump over people. Oh, yeah. Mm. Nice. Bro, oh, nice. Jump. Good. All right. Another fight. We got this. Let's go. Try for some drunken cleric action here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's the drunken thing. <laughs> I'm not sure this is such a great weapon for Breakout. It seemed fun at the time. I'm, I'm losing my uh, affinity for it. It seems to do a lot of damage to us. But, uh... Eric, you might want to use, um, you might want to rethink what weapon you're using. I think it's not a plus one weapon. The hammer that I'm your, using? Uh, yeah, the, the hammer. You've got that, um, that sword we got off the drider that's probably better for you. It's it's uh, I can I can show you in a second here. It's actually not because that's what I was using. But we'll wait till the battle's done here. I'll show you. Oh, I need to end my. No, oh, I did. I ended my turn. Yeah, I'm just seeing if I have anything left to do. Yeah, so I'll show you the the weapon that you're talking about. Fate. So um, oh, I can't because it's not my turn. All right. Trying to use a crossbow like right up against you. That's yeah, not, that's up not close. Gonna, that's not gonna work out. Did you get rid of that chair leg? That like makes you strong. Uh, do this do with the club? You mean? Yeah. No, I've still got it. I think. Oh. Why? Why? Ah, oh, that's so annoying. Sorry. Jesus Louise, terrible. Choice but to keep going. Okay, hit the bad guy. Break out. Yay! Ooh. Oh, jeez. Oh, no. <laughs> what is this? Oh, no. Okay. Oh, okay. Weird. Um, hmm. Okay, well, uh, Sparrow. Oh, no, we can all level up except Breakout can't level up. Do you guys want to? Let's do a level up before you do anything else. Level up time. Level seven. Mm -hmm. Oh, I get level four spells. Uh, fighters are so boring. <laughs> I get nothing. <laughs> There's like, I get a feat. Uh, I mean, my feats are good, but it's like fighters are so simple. Um, let's see. What do I want? Yeah, true, dude. Breakout's mace is... I'll show it to you in a second. It's, uh, it's uh, the drunken bat or something like that. The 
something. But basically he gets a bonus, so he does a little AoE whenever he's intoxicated by alcohol and hits with it. Well, chat, what do you think for a fighter? What's a good uh, what's a good feat for a primary sort of tanky fighter? The one I took before was Sentinel, which has been very useful. Could just go more heavy armor mastery. That might be useful <clears throat> for what we're trying to do here. Heavy armor master seems good. I get a one. I get one to my strength up to a maximum of twenty. My strength is is lower because um, it's sixteen right now, so I get one to that. And all non magical damage decreases by three while I'm wearing heavy armor. So it just seems like uh, seems solid. Like we're all deep in thought about how we're doing this. Yeah, I get level four spell slot as well. Plus I get to pick a circle of the land that's always prepared. Hmm. I've picked out my spells. I'm just um, uh, scribing stuff as well now. Nice. I'm going to go heavy spells. armor master just because that armor we found from the adamantine forge was so good. I want to uh, lean into that and might as well accentuate that as much as possible. See you, Tolmart. Thanks for stopping in. As always, appreciate you uh, stopping by to say hi, and I uh, hope you have a great rest of your day, dude. Yeah, I'll go Heavy Armor Master. Except. All right. So uh, you were asking while you're while you're still setting up your level up, I will show you this. So the weapon I'm using is called the Intransigent Intransigent Warhammer. It's four to eleven. It does every time I uh, get a killing blow or a critical hit, it knocks all the foes around prone. It's 4 to 11, one-handed. The sword you're talking about is called uh, Cruel Sting. This is the one we got off the drider. But it's only good if you're a drow, because a drow wielding it gets one to four poison damage against restrained you targets. You all robotic. I... Oh, Discord is maybe having issues again. Mm-hmm. Think, yeah, okay, but can, uh, it's a, it. it's plus one. It's one d eight plus one, versus your hammer, which is just one d eight with no plus one. So even though you're not a drow, it's still probably better than your hammer. The hammer is one d ten plus three. It's one d eight because you're not too handy then. Oh, it's one d eight. Hmm. I'm going to stick with it a little longer mm -hmm. and see how it works out. Just give me one second. I'm just going to move. The, uh, the Twist of Fortune is also probably pretty good. Because that deals damage even when you miss. Which one were you saying? The twist of fate, the the, mm. the mace you've got. Mm -hmm. Twist yeah. of fortune, sorry. Twist of fortune. Yeah. The thing with what this do we is. Do with that, what do we do with that leg, the chair leg? I think Breakout has it, maybe? Kill dog. Come closer. He's yelling at us. <laughs> yeah, he is. Yeah, well, we're leveling up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Settle down now. Yeah, it looks yeah, like... I think he just wants to talk. <laughs> All right, well, while you guys are leveling, I'll talk to this guy. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm done leveling. Okay. Now. 
Okay, he's just telling us to head inside. Okay, so if you guys are done, Moving ahead. did we loot up? Did everybody get the check for loots here? I did not. I assume fate's gone. Yeah, I just assume <laughs> fate's taking care of this. You don't come yeah, there wasn't anything. Okay. Well, let's go talk to this thing that emerged. Wait, what are those all up there? Ghoul medics. All right, well, we might be in for another fight here. Oh, you know, there's a chest over here. Let me do a save mm -hmm. after, after you're done leaving their fate. Okay, saving. Okay, game saved. Let me throw a heal on Sparrow as well. She's not looking too healthy there. Throw another one on you. He's got a couple more spell slots. Again. Secure. Be okay. I can. Uh, Let's get going. Also, I always forget I have this. Oh, saloon, saloon stream. Nice. Yeah, it has a chance of putting them to sleep for a couple of turns, but when we're out of combat, it's not a big deal, right? It's basically just a free heal. Right. Okay. Well, let's go in here and see what the not over. see what the situation is. They're not hostile. Ah, the inter failed something. And in one piece as well. Not just any true soul would have oh, succeeded in following my <laughs> path through this place. You should be pleased. Hmm. Okay. Uh, who are you? Oh, he's gross. Fought a battle right under your nose. Whoever you are, some help would have been useful. Truth will bold of you to assume I'm a comrade. Naturally born. That's a strange thing to hold against someone. Well, let's just find you out who this guy are is. A true soul. There is no excuse for you to not recognize your betters. But never mind. Your he has a pentagon on his face. Mm -hmm. This is gross. I am Balthazar, yeah. chief advisor to General Thor, and entrusted with a mission of utmost importance. Do you know what is at stake here? <laughs> I'm looking for the relic. Can you help me? <laughs> a history, history check. Um, the name Balthazar seems vaguely familiar, but from where? Sure, so, um, hold on a second. This is something that's interesting, um, because this guy's a tr truth soul, and he's assisting General Torm, but General Torm was originally like a Shar worshiper who was aided by the Dark, dark Justiciers, who we just fought, and these guys helped us fight them. So now General Torm seems to have switched sides in his new. Uh, undead life <laughs> or maybe this guy his maybe he has an agenda of some sort that's in conflict with what torm wants maybe he's decided to try and use us for his own ends or something so i'm asking about his name let's see if we can succeed on a history check about the name balthazar <clears throat> Ooh. Hi. okay it comes back to you Balthazar headed a monastic order that controlled a place called Amkethran in the deserts of Kalimshan. But he is long dead from what you recall. Well, this guy looks kind of long dead. <laughs> um, hmm. Mm -hmm. I heard of a monk by that name once. He died. Oh, him. Yes, I decided to take his name for myself. After taking his rib bones. Suits me better, I think. But enough idle chatter. Keep to the matter at hand. You do know what's at stake here. Yes? Enlighten me, my good friend. There is a relic here. Mm -hmm. One which General Thorne desires. No, needs. I will retrieve it for him. And you will help me. Ignorant you may be, you've shown some prowess in scouting and combat by making it this far. 
This necromancer has Catherick's trust. Helping him could be just what you need to gain access to the man himself. <laughs> so he wants to use us, but we also want to use him. That's basically what's going on here. I got a fighter and a persuasion option. A scout is little good if they don't know what to look for. What does this relic do? Yeah. Come on, give it double thirteens. <laughs> Oh man, that's just one short. Okay, I'm gonna try it again. That's important. I've got inspiration. Like I've got double. I've got advantage on this. There's no way I should fail this. Oh my Same gosh. thing again. Well, it depends on what the one d four is. I can get better on that. True. Yeah. Hey. Okay. Fine. If it'll spare me your bleeding. The relic lends the general his strength, his invulnerability. It must be recovered before his enemies attempt to exploit it. <laughs> that sounds like your problem, not mine. I think I'd rather exploit the relic after I've gotten rid of you. Uh, what do you guys think? This is kind of where we have to make a decision about how, how far are we willing to go to get the relic, right? Right. Do we need his help to get the relic? It sounds like he needs our help to get the relic. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it does kind of sound like his problem, not mine, right? Like, I don't know. That's what I'm thinking. You like number two, Fate? I was thinking number three. <laughs> okay, so that's going to be a fight, right? You want to take these guys out, Sparrow? Yeah. You decide. What do you think, Sparrow? I mean, he's gross. I don't mind killing him. <laughs> I'm I love... just thinking we're going to we're gonna want to kill General Torm anyway, right? We need uh -huh. the relic to do that, to, to, to destroy his invulnerability or whatever. You so we're going to have to come to blows with this guy eventually, I would think. You've both convinced me. We're doing it. I think I'd rather exploit this relic after I've gotten rid of you. <laughs> Wasted on an idiot mind, I see. I'll salvage what parts I can from you. Here we go. Choices were made. <laughs> Let us make short work of this. There's a lot of them. Yeah. Okay, so he's casting Ray of Sickness on Breakout. Well, he needs a 17. They rolled a 23. I can do Warding Flare, which imposes disadvantage. Probably makes him have to roll again. Okay. Ow. Oh. Holy crap. Yeah, 22. That was a lot of damage. <laughs> that was a lot of damage. Hey, Joe. Good morning. Welcome, welcome. You don't think you've tried this particular route yet? We, it's funny how many times we've heard that in our playthrough that people are like, oh, I didn't do that. I, I did something different here. That's what makes this game awesome. Okay, so I would say we need to go after Balthazar. Well, there's all these medics here. Are they going to heal him? Oh, yeah. oh, geez. I just got knocked prone by something. That was me. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I no. thought you said you would never cast that spell again, Fate. I, I remember a this particular a stream... This is a different spell. Uh -huh. It's a different spell. Sure. <laughs> well, at least the two guys on me are prone as well. <laughs> yeah, I'm prone too, so. Uh, just let me play uh, the damn game. I don't know, man. We'll see. This will be an interesting week. Uh, Here we got, so there's two medics, and then there's the big guy. There's a flesh golem. Hey, why does he get up? And the boss. It's his turn. Oh! Boo. Get him, Sparrow. Oh, he keeps trying to turn me. Oh, he knocks there again as well. Yeah. Breakout's not, though. Breakout's going to be, as soon as it gets to his turn, he'll be okay. That flash golem has 182 hit points. I did a little bit of damage to him, though. Oh, yeah. 30? That's not bad. Yeah. It's at 158. Yeah. All right. Breakout needs to get in. We need to do some radiant, radiant damage here. Um, so, let's see here. What do we got? So I'm all out of level three spell slots. I've got one level two left. I can do. Do 
Try a flaming sphere. Yeah, we're going to try a flaming sphere on these uh, medics over here. Try and get them taken out. You're going to melt my ice. <laughs> yeah, sacrifices have to be made. Yeah, probably a good thing. Saved. Shoot. <laughs> the sphere can jump. <laughs> I don't think we need to jump. We'll just leave the sphere where it is. Well, so much for peace. And then uh, we'll go bring Breakout off the ice, get him off the ice, or keep him off the ice. Swift as my feet can carry me. It will be a kind. <laughs> Did he get the yeah, fell over? He slipped on the ice. Oh, cloud kill. Oh, oh my god. Oh, dang. Oh. He got me with it around the corner. You know what? Uh, cloud kill. Uh is dead. Okay, let me let me see if I can get up there and go get this guy because that is he's killing us. Um I gotta get out of here somehow. I gotta get out of this cloud. It really limits your movement when you're in the cloud. Jeez. And the ice. Mm -hmm. There's not a lot I can do here. I'm gonna just hit. I'm just gonna hit the flesh golem since I'm right next to him and I have advantage. I can't uh, misty step right now. I um, you used your bonus action. I did. Yep. Oh, jeez. Now mm -hmm. dead. <laughs> dead. Dead. Yep. That. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I think we are regretting it. I think we're going to regret uh, choosing that option. We might be looking at second reload of the game here. Yeah. Yikes. Oh, game over. <laughs> That's it. Game over. <laughs> game over. All right. Well, wow. good thing we saved. Dang. <laughs> I think the problem is we're a teeny bit underleveled. You think so? Yeah, I think so. Okay. Well... Um, then we can try the we can try the more peaceful Do some quests. Yeah, we'll, side quests and stuff. Well, we could. I mean, we could go. We could sort of like exit out and try and go do some stuff. But I mean, maybe we just take the not confrontational option here. <laughs> yeah, I think we kind of have to. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, everybody back in the pool. We can still be like, oh, we can still like go play along with it, right? And then just take the medic or take the uh, relic for ourselves. Yeah, we'll just betray him at the first opportunity we get. Ah, not just any true soul would have succeeded in following you, but never mind. Do you know Let's take what the is same at stake options. here? Yeah, we did the history check before. We'll add the bonus. Nice. It comes back to you. Balthazar headed a monastic order that controlled a place called the... Oh, him. But enough idle chatter. Keep... There is a relic here. One which Je and you will This necromancer has Kethrek's trust. Helping him could be just what you need to gain access to the man himself. Oh nice. Yeah, first try that time, so we saved Fine. an inspiration. If it'll spare me your bleating. The relic lends the general his strength, his invulnerability. It must be recovered before his enemies attempt to exploit it. 
All right. You need my help? I do not need you or your help. But you are here in spite of that, so I may as well make use of you. The relic is close, but the way is barred and Shah's dead are uncooperative. Clear the path for me by blade, cunning, or whatever it takes. I will remain here until you have succeeded or fallen. Okay, so we can say I'll see what I can do. What exactly will you be doing while I'm out risking myself? Or we can Persuasion. Pers you have resources to spare. Give me something to aid my search. Yeah. Give me the goods. 14. Negative one charisma. Hey. Yeah, that's his eye. Yeah. All right. That's my eye guy. <laughs> if it was intimidation, I'd have a bonus. I will assign flesh to aid you on Whoa. your way. We get the flesh golem with us. Ring this bell. And he will come. <laughs> My brother is no intellectual powerhouse, but he is strong, loyal, and punctual. Should a fight turn against you, remember the bell. <laughs> okay. Take the bell. Wait, he is your brother? In part, yes. My poor unborn twin. Mother always resented me for it, it said does. I strangled him in the womb. If you can believe such tripe. Besides, once I developed my powers, I fetched him from the graveyard and brought him back. Gave him a new, better body. Alas, Mother was not. Do you think we'll find his mother somewhere in here? <laughs> no. Uh, okay, let's just take the bell. <laughs> Flesh will remain here until called. But don't fear. He has very sharp hearing. I chose his ears myself. Now, get to work. <laughs> okay, summon Golem Bell. Uh, yeah, Joe, we are level 7. We just leveled up to 7, so... Let's get out of here. Yeah, let's get out of here. This guy's creeping me out. Where's that bell? I just want to make sure okay, it's in my inventory. Where's that bloody bell? There's a lot of doors over here. They're locked. Oops. Do we want to do maybe a short rest to get some health back? Uh, yes. I don't want to use up breakout spell slots again. That was a mistake. Uh, I'll feel that one later. Okay. Short rest completed. Oh, there's a couple of pairs of doors. Yeah, what's this? Hmm. There's some vault doors over here, and then there's some double oak doors on the other side. They're both locked? They're both locked, yeah. Well, let's try and open this. Uh, don't give me trouble now. Oh my gosh, it's a dice. It's a DC 30. I'm never getting this. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah maybe maybe not. You don't have very many um, yeah, I don't. Uh, lock picks, I don't think. Well, unless we find a key, we'll have to just leave those for now. So if we look at our map... Um... What about this other this other set of doors over here? Okay, we'll try that one. Yeah, he didn't tell us exactly where the path was. He just sort of said the path was whatever. Mm -hmm. Guarded by undead and they're not cooperative. Uh, this one is an 18. I could try this one. I'll give it a go. I think I got it. Yep. yep. Uh oh. Oh, it's saving. <laughs> yeah, I heard spider chitters. Oh, there, there's rats over here worshiping this coffin, it looks like. Alter yeah. to Shar. Alter to Shar, yeah. Sparrow, you want to talk to these rats and see what they're up to? Feed your um, bodies and rest your minds. I could. Lady I'd Shire have to hop out of form, but I can do that. And ready. I have two available, so. Uh, this is like a rats? camping area. It does look like a camping area. area. Like a safe place to camp. 
We outnumber you. Leave me be. Nope. <laughs> it's either attacking or... Yeah, same thing or... as before. Hey. Yeah. The rats have done nothing to us, so... They don't Ooh, I want... found a key. Oh, maybe it's for the doors on the other side. Mm. Could be. Could also have been for the door we just unlocked. Oh, or maybe it's these doors over here. Oh, dang, there's a bunch of uh, <laughs> stuff. Uppity rats, Joe says. Another double doors in here. Yeah, there's a whole bunch of stuff in here. There's a whole bunch of stuff in here. It's like a little kitchen. Bunch of uh, alchemy ingredients. Mm -hmm. Ooh, mushroom soup. <laughs> Gigantic mushrooms on the table over here. There's a burlap sack. What's in there? Nothing. So does that right, key I'm open these doors? these doors? Yeah. It does. Uh -huh, it did. Interesting. So where does this go? Oh, there's a chest. What's hiding here? Gilded chest. Uh oh, for an ambush. Oh no! <laughs> we got ambushed by a cloaker. Oh wow! A couple of them it looks like. Oh okay, yeah. Two cloakers. Three phantasms now. I think the cloaker's creating the phantasms. Okay, I'm frightened. Oh gosh, I'm frightened too now. So we'll have uh, we'll have disadvantage now. So is I think we got to start with the cloaker here. I think he's creating these phantasms. Um, can I misty step to get up beside him? Probably. Yes. Okay, I'm gonna misty step to get up beside the cloaker, unless you guys had other ideas. Going around the back way. Okay. See if I can get to him. I'm still sneaking, so. <clears throat> right, disadvantage, but that's because I'm frightened, so that's okay. He's going in. Miss. Hit for seven. It's got 105 hit points. Where do I go from here? Okay, look out. Okay, what are you doing, Fate? Fireball. Nice. Okay. That's saved. Uh, we'll do a Radiance. Alright. Oh, that did some stuff. Moan do. That's so weird. I don't know. We've we've saved against it, so <laughs> yeah, not doing anything. Uh, moan. It's one d six psychic damage. Produce a piercing one frightens nearby enemies. Okay, so it's damage and frightening. Okay, let's see if we can't get this guy down some more. Thirty three hit points. That's too much. Okay. Remember, if call lightning hits you guys. 
not sure. That's good. Okay, so the main cloaker is down to 45. Okay, well. Life comes easy these days. So let's see. Can I get up to here with breakout? Yes, I can. Go ahead, get the breakout. Okay, so the cloaker's down to 38. Okay. <laughs> <So good. laughs> Magic missile machine gun. <laughs> How many does that hit for? Is it like four? Jeez. That was um that was uh scorching rain. I did yeah, five attacks with it. <laughs> wow. So that took care of everything. It's uh, as usual. Okay, let's see what the cloaker had on him. And absolutely nothing. I guess the reward is what's in the chest. Wait, can't reach this. Oh. <laughs> I can't get there before fate. Uh, anything good? Oh, a couple of interesting arrows. This uh, it's basically an arrow that silences the target. Pass that over to you. Okay. In an arrow of darkness. Remind me that I have that when we face when we end up fighting the what's his face there, Balthazar. Oh yeah. That will be useful. Yeah, I don't have any other of those. That's the only arrow of arcane interference I've ever seen. Cool. Well, that was a nice little, uh, nice little fight stash room, I guess. Back out to the main area. Want to save, maybe? That's a good idea. Saving. Okay, save successful. All right, so back out here. And we'll see if we grabbed the key. I don't think that, that key was for that room, not for the other room, but we'll try it again just in case. These rats did not want us to go in here and mess up their altar, so. Let's. Oh, there's a lever here. Can we take this lever? <laughs> or does this just open the door? I think it just opened. Oh! The lever is for that elevator we found. Yeah, but I don't think we can take it. I can't, like, remove it. It's sort of like attached to the thing we can't take it off the device oh it's for the is it for the uh oh it's for the doors yeah. okay well did you talk to the uh rats or or try to loot the altar or we, didn't, we talked to the rats we didn't loot the altar though i'm assuming the rats will attack if we yeah bother their stuff what do you guys think oh i'm in a cutscene. Oh, okay Oh, I can pray at the altar. Yeah. Why not? Sure. Oh, that's a... Working. Hey. I got it. Nice roll. A pleasurable shiver runs down your spine. You feel as if you've unburdened a troubling thought and forgotten it forever. That's the first time I've ever mm. seen the smile on your face. <laughs> <laughs> you've, you've, the first time you've ever been happy. <laughs> Oh, I'm resistant to necrotic damage until my next long rest. Oh, oh, that might be useful. Okay, well, I guess the rats didn't care so much if we went in there and played around with their altar. Okay, well, let's carry on. Since we can't go in these doors over here and we can't find a, another key for it. The rat's saying something different, guys. Oh. I'm in a, oh, I was wondering if you prayed at it, if it would. But what? Okay. Um, You've got an insight and an animal handling. Yeah. Let me try. Study the rat's behavior. Sure. Yeah, I'd study the yeah, rat's behavior. Yeah, I think behavior. that's a better one. Yep. Yeah, you got to get more one. bonuses. Yep. So seven, all you need to roll is better than that. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Oh, my gosh. you got inspiration, though. You should be able to. Oh, oh so my gosh. That's so horrible. Okay, you I got to try it again. Yeah, that's a good one to try again with. There you go. There, there we go. go. <laughs> <laughs> the rat holds its ground. It almost seems defiant. Are you not talking to animals anymore? Is that the problem? 
No, I am. That's how I'm talking to him. Mm -hmm. what, what is your insight? So you get plus four on the insight check. Try the insight. All right. Nice. The rat isn't merely territorial, it's proud. This place means a great deal to it. Hmm. Mm. Interesting. All right, I'll pick number one. Yeah. We've always been here. It's ours. We watch over it. You do not belong. Leave. Away. My nest. My dark. Okay. Hmm. Well, interesting. I don't know if we'll ever find out the secret of the the rat, <laughs> but the rat. <laughs> <laughs> it was worth looking into. I'm glad you checked it again. So, what do you guys think? Do you want to head back to the main area and then try that other set again, and maybe not attack the displacer beast so quickly? Well, isn't there another way we can go? There was like past that other rat down back mm -hmm. down this way. Oh yeah, That's okay. true. down down the stairs. There's nothing. Mm -hmm. Although I think looking at the map, oops, sorry, um, close door on accident. The relic seems to be over there where that displacer beast is. Yeah, we might have to go that way. So I think yeah, I think we'll go eventually be going that way. But well, let's see what this rat does if we try and walk past it. Nothing. Okay. Got a dual scout. Orders from B. Nothing of I mean... value comes easy. Oh. Overcome my trials and win my embrace. What did that note oh, say, Fate? A standing torch. I almost wonder if you can use that as a lever. Oh. Uh, yeah. Pay close attention. Seek the means to access the relic. Search in the library. Do not deviate. Do not fail. Return promptly. Hmm. Well, the torch, you just, when you access it, it, when you use it, it just turns it on. It just lights it up. Oh. So I don't think we can un unhook it and take it with us, unfortunately. Oh. Okay, well, we've got some doors over here. And a plaque on the ground. Oh, I probably should have read the plaque first. <laughs> treasure. Okay. Her most wanted treasure. Oh. The Gauntlet of Shard is a book over here. This might give us a, a hint. The gauntlet of Shar, from where an army of dark justiciers shall rise and join battle against those who shun her embrace. It is said that the name of this most sacred of sites has two meanings. Firstly, it is a series of trials that Lady Shar's initiates must surpass if they are to join her most vaulted ranks. Secondly, it represents the most martial facet of the Night Singer's embrace, the armored fist that shall crush her foes but gently cradle those who serve her. <laughs> Initiates cannot advance to Lady Shar's final test until they have earned the rite of passage. Each trial shall yield an umbral gem. Each gem shall bring the victor closer to the Night Singer. Okay. Will those Which... gems go in that platform thing? Right. Probably. Yes. Once the way is clear, the final sacrifice beckons and spilled cellulite blood shall herald the rise of a new dark, dark justicier. <laughs> spilled cellulite blood. You guys, um, leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> no, not your blood. Different, different selenite. Mm -hmm, so what, mm -hmm. what's in the? I'll treasure? be keeping my eye on you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is called the soft step trial. That's what came up when I entered the room. So, let's let's try and do this one person at a time. I'm gonna I'm gonna Just sneak. Who's our best sneaker? It's probably not me. Um, no, as a ranger. Um. Yeah, but I'm wearing a bunch of like I'm wearing heavy armor. And, oh. I yeah. don't get all the bonuses. Yeah, it's either, surprisingly, it'll be either me or, or Sparrow, probably Sparrow, especially if what? she goes into um, Sneaky Panther yeah. form. Okay. Do, is it Dex or something? Like, how do you know? Uh, if you hit I, and then on the left-hand side, there's the little little head-looking tab, um, and you can see uh, your, your stealth bonus. Um, I have got plus two. Mine is plus five right now. Oh, is it? Yeah. What's your sparrow? I don't see what. So it's... in so we, on the inventory screen, right? You see on the left side under your name, there's three tabs. There's um, the head, like on the in the oh, middle. Okay. If you go into the the middle one, 
you'll see your bonus, your checks. Stealth is plus five. Okay. So oh, you, you have disadvantage, though, uh, Sparrow, because of your armor. Yeah. So, Sparrow, can you sneak in there? Just as regular or as cat? You can probably just do it as regular. Okay. And see what the soft step trial is all about. Mm-hmm. Look around. There's dead body over there. Probably don't want to go that way. Right. <laughs> okay. uh, skeleton over there. I could also just like teleport over there. <laughs> <laughs> you could. I mean, why don't you try that? That sounds. Do we want? To... Do you want me to try that? Yeah, sure. To this, to the bowl. Yeah, you might try it. I don't see anything that's yeah. like. We're not, there's no like um, vision cone on the ground that we're actively avoiding, so I mean. Yeah. So, what can you do from there? Oh gosh. What? And it's your blood. <laughs> yeah, you're the selenite. I mean, this is what it wants. It wants uh, your blood. Come on, do it. All right. Be a, be a team player. All right. You'll get some more back. <laughs> <laughs> you're also immune to necrotic nice. damage, so that's good. What am I supposed to do? Okay, so I feel like I'm missing something here. That you said. Oh, there's oh, something in there. Yeah, there's something in there that's looking around. Yep. There is a shadow. Oh. Okay. These birds have seen everything. And your blood on the floor, apparently. <laughs> yeah, you, you left a puddle. Oh, oh, breakout just about got seen there. Let's get going. Out of sight. So do we have to kill? Oh, so this looks like a it's like a maze, right? Breathe deep and move. Where do we need to go? Good question. Wonder if you go in between those two boxes. Can't see. Yeah. So we're, I guess the goal is not to get seen by the shadow here. Yeah. Can you like teleport around through this gate? Um, I I can try. Your teleport's a, a cantrip, right? No, it does use some spell slots, but I do have a few mm. spell slots left. Let me see here. Okay. It's gonna go okay, that way. Okay, he's going in a loop, so it's yeah, like a big in, square. In a loop. Yep. Yeah. There's <laughs> two of them. Two. He's gonna turn into there, and I think he's gonna come come back there's two yeah that's why yeah oh okay so then go then fake I go can... you got this step carefully there's, tra tra there's traps too oh geez joe i i appreciate that i i totally can imagine it must be hard to uh <laughs> if you know what to, the deal is here to keep uh keep it yourself but we're hold on it's coming it's coming uh... it's coming <laughs> <laughs> no no you're good you're good you're good no panic. Okay. <laughs> nice, nice. You got this. You spilled blood for your sacrifice was not gonna be in vain. Where are we trying to get to though? There's nothing back here. I think fate's gonna find something up here. Okay, there's how do I Yeah, how do you get it's that? locked? Okay, you can see the orb in there. Hmm. Do we need a thief to pick that lock? There's got to be a key in here somewhere. Yeah, can you knock on that door? Like, I don't even see the option to interact with it. I don't see... How do you... Hmm. Yeah, I don't. Um, 
Oh, there's a lever back here. Let me. Oh my god. Does that open the gate? It opens that gate. Yeah. Now there's got to be another lever that opens the main gate then. I'm, I'm thinking. Okay, let me just see if I can take a look around here. and I'll try and sneak and see what I can find. Maybe there's something. Oh, I found a disarm kit. That's good. I could teleport into... There is another lever back here. Okay. There is. Yeah. Can you um... get to it, Sparrow? Oh, I see it. I see it. You got it? Like, you see where it is? I see where it is. I don't know if I can get back to it easily. Okay. That's a friendly look. Yeah, because I have to go almost all the way back. Derek, do you think, maybe if you take your armor off, do you think you can sneak up and get to that lever? I can certainly try. Okay, removing armor. Yeah. We're going, <laughs> we're going naked. No, 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 no. It's not very far. Can Where is it? I don't even know where it is. Uh, let's see, how do I do this again? There you go. Did you see that? Um... Where's this lever? Because I stepped over the chair. Oh, okay. I think I, I think Sparrow's going for nope. it. Oh. Yep. Where is it? I lost oh, it back now. The way, back the way you came. Where the trap is? Yeah. Oh, there's before. something coming. <laughs> uh... Okay, I'll try and... I think I see what you're talking about. Where the heck is it? Oh, you hit Oh, it's... I... Captain! Okay, there you go. <laughs> it's... it's... can you see the, where I'm... where I'm pinging? Uh... Oh, Why okay, I see it, I see it. it, I see where you're... I see where you're pinging. First step is the and then it's over... it's right over here. Okay, I'm going for it. No good with this map stuff. No, no, it's coming. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. We're caught. Oh, no. Ah, oh, no. Successful hiding. Successful hiding. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Why can't I see this stupid thing? Oh, I got kicked out. Oh, good. That's it. I just oh, got okay. It doesn't out. attack you. It just kicks you out. Out of sight. Okay. Well, that's good Why to know. I see that's... this thing? So if you you wait for it to pass, and then you should be able to like. Um, oh, I also found a button. Found Wait, a button. You know what buttons yeah. are good for? How do you ping? Uh, Alt, right click. Oh, there is a button. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they just send you back to the start. <sighs> Well, Fate, maybe you should come back and, and do this since we're failing miserably. <laughs> well, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of out of teleports. Uh, okay, I see where the button is, at least. The lever is right next to it. Okay. Should mind my step. Time to press ahead. Yeah, if you go just, like, straight down there, you should have a... Yeah, I think the button probably opens that wall next to it. Alright, where's the lever? So go ahead and hit the button, and then the lever is like right next to it. Yeah, there it is. I see it's right to your left sparrow. Oh, okay. Nope, 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 Missing another lever or something like that? Hmm. Well, we nothing but do but to keep looking around here. Gotta be something. I could just teleport through it, but I'm not sure I'd be able to make my way back out. Oh, I got. <laughs> You're back, <laughs> back with us. Welcome to the club. <laughs> this is kind of fun, actually. I have to keep going. So... Something good here, I hope. Why are you naked? <laughs> because it, my heavy armor hurts my stealth checks. That's hilarious. Yeah, we're going, we're going, we're going au natural for this one. Although my stealth oh, is still plus five. Whatever, it's fun. 
I'm also finding uh, disarming kits in these vases and crates. Oh, that was fire. Oh, what's that? Oh, the trap. Yeah, I hit the trap. On this thing. <laughs> I hit the trap and then got seen by the thing. Oh, there's a. Oh no, that's another trap. I don't need any attention right now. Let's try that again. I wonder if the gods are watching me. So this is like a dead end now. You can't, you can't go any further. That was the button? Yeah, I think so. so it's got to be through here. It's got to be over this side. Oops. Have you ever done Oh, man. Change it? Oh, it just gives disadvantage. Right. Thanks, Joe. Okay, I'm going to try and disarm this event. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> he's coming. Let's be careful. There he turns. So he actually stops. Oh, no, don't go there. Okay, I've got 10 disarm kits. So I'm going to try and disarm some of these traps. Not, not with that kind of one. Fico. Come back in a. Oh, you walked past. <laughs> so I disarmed the trap, but it's still firing, unfortunately. Nice. Okay, so we're over here. Am, am I just like this? <laughs> I'm just getting death by a thousand paper cuts here. Fire damage for one. And... <laughs> oh, dang it. Poor. So I think we can we can <laughs> we can get a hint if we should choose to want a hint. But nah. we're gonna work this out. I gotta get we're gonna work this out. <laughs> Disarm again. So I can't disarm traps and remain stealth. So every time I go to disarm a trap, the guy sees me, the shadow sees me, but I've got them all disarmed on the left side here now. Best be on my way. Dang, dang, I meant to click something and it walked me right into it. Okay, I, <laughs> I see a lever. I'm gonna go for this lever. I'm gonna disarm this plate. Oh no, he's gonna see me. the plate but he also sent it back so breathe deep and move this <laughs> is just gonna take a while where is the shadow going oh he comes all the way out actually better be cautious on my way okay I gotta sneak in behind him while he's gone get in there what if we turned on all the lights and then the shadows couldn't be shadow that's a good idea. <laughs> I don't know. Why have we not thought of that? I was actually... Oh, you know what? I was actually trying to do the opposite and turn them all off. Oh. Um... Let me try, because there is this one right here. Oh, I was just about because to move out of the thing. Because they're they're saying that the, a true child of the night embraces the shadows, so maybe we need to turn all of the lights off. Oh. 
There were a couple that were already on in the... Yeah, that makes sense. Shoot. Like, if there's no light source... I, I had been turning them on. So let's... Um, so... Okay. That didn't really do anything. Let's see. Oh, no, this guy's gonna... Child of the night. Joe, you're probably, like, father can I go? laughing at us, <laughs> watching us fail repeatedly at this. But we will get it eventually. It's a matter of time. I just, I just so want to, like, just teleport in there. But I don't know if I'll be able to get back out. Okay, so that was the thing that we me. did before. Oh, the walls just moved. Yeah, it's because I'm hitting the lever that you were you were hitting before. Oh. Well, there must be other levers. Oh. Okay, let's just take a look here. This is really challenging. Yeah, I'm gonna pull this lever. All right, that's you can see on the floor where the walls move. All right, I pulled a lever. Okay, so that's the original <laughs> configuration. That when it starts out, that's the configuration. It's Ugh. Like, that's okay. Let's see if that uh, makes a difference now, because now we can go through the middle. The middle was unavailable when that lever had been pulled. No, it's still closed. And fate's in there. <laughs> oh, something we did good. I just, I just decided to take it. Just, I just teleported in there, and then I took it. <laughs> huh. Okay, can you and get out of there now? I don't know. Let me try this. There's an humble transporter. Okay, yeah. Is that the? Do you just have to teleport in there? Is that just what you have to do? Maybe. I'm sure there's more than one solution. It would not be Baldur's Gate 3 if it was a single solution, but you got the thing, so... I yeah. Mean... How do we get out now? Mm. Mm. Interesting. I could have saved us a whole lot of time if I had just teleported in. <laughs> That's all right. It's all good. Okay, I guess... There I... was this, um... Oh, there's a key! Where? In, there's this room in the middle that we couldn't get to. We must have needed to, like, uh, move the walls around or something. Yeah, that's got to be what uh, it was. And so we just hadn't moved the walls to the right configuration. Right. There's a key right there. I was looking for something like that, but I just didn't see it. Yeah, I totally didn't see it either. That's weird. But... So, like... All's well that ends well. <laughs> so, like, yeah. if I... Oh, yeah, there it is. We could have just... There, and the key was right Oh, and there. the key is on the table. How did we not see that key? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, I said we would, and we did. So we figured it out. Okay, so we have... Um, we're almost near at the end of our stream time here. So before we engage in the next trial of Char, perhaps we should put a bookmark in it. And uh, a save. Yeah, okay. So let's, <laughs> let me do a quick save here, and we'll, we'll call it. Well, we spent most of our time getting our ass whooped. Um, <laughs> did. Either by uh, by combat or by trials. Mm -hmm. Yes, we did. Um, so I, I, and I know, chat, you probably see it like uh, Theric, or um, Breakout can level up. I have been avoiding leveling him up because I want to let uh, Breakout actually do his own character the way he wants. So, um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll start the next stream with uh, our cleric getting a level. Um, so, yeah, Joe, how did you do it differently? Um, yeah, because he says he did it differently than the way we did it, which is the beauty of the game. Exactly. I'm curious as to how you accomplish that because that's uh that's kind of neat but um yeah so uh make sure you are tuned into the channel here for this week because we will be streaming pantheon uh twice this week at least twice this week and um oh you did it through stealth and a misty step through one of the walls that makes sense that sort of ended up being what we did just with a different uh, different tool but um, as I was saying, yeah, we'll be streaming Monday night on our uh, the Monday night after dark streams. That's midnight on our Twitch channel with Drak and his crew. 
Um, and then on Thursday, the 201, um, of which uh, we are a part of, all, th all of us here, uh, will be playing Pantheon. And um, we have some, uh, some characters set up and ready to go. And uh, looking forward to streaming that because it's the first time we're able to sort of uh, stream it on the 201 show. Um, but uh, otherwise, uh, Sparrow Fate, anything else from you guys coming up this week? Anything you wanted to mention? No, I'm just going to try and get better and play some Pantheon. <laughs> Uh, I don't think I have anything coming up this week. Yeah. Okay, good. Well, then I will see you all on Thursday. And uh, chat, everyone, thanks for coming out. I really appreciate it. And uh, we'll uh, we'll be back next uh, weekend, same time, same place, to uh, continue, the, uh, continue the adventure. So everyone have a great week. We'll see you next time. Guys. Nice.